Right, two local men say they now have a lifelong bond after spending the last year together fighting for their lives. Fox 40's Gene Nguyen is joining us live at Sutter Medical Center in Midtown Sacramento with how the pair credit one another for saving each other's lives, Jeannie. Nikki, these two men met at this hospital here about a year ago after being told they had heart failure and not much time left to live. But today they are stronger than ever and they reunited with a lot of gratitude for one another. It's a happy day for Wendell Stallworth and Dave Ford. <laughs> celebrating life after both being diagnosed with heart failure last year. And while today is a happy day, these men at one point were given only a few months to live. I was at the lowest point in my life. I had no energy to do anything basically. For 47 days, Ford was at the Sutter Health Medical Center, hoping to get his heart in better condition. At the same time, Stallworth was also fighting to stay alive. We would pass by each other and um, look at each other through the windows because of, of course, COVID that you couldn't really go. Their bond quickly strengthened as they both realized they were fighting for the same thing. Obviously going through the same thing, we felt like we were already kind of brothers kind of to start. While they both waited for a heart transplant, they each had help from the Impella heart pump, a small device that helps the heart pump while patients are waiting for a new heart. It's about the size of a pencil and it's put in through either an artery in the chest or an artery through the leg. Dr. Robert Kincaid performed the heart transplant on both men and says today is a full circle moment, seeing them so happy and healthy. It warms my heart, you know, it's uh, that's why we do this. And through it all. He made it definitely a lot easier for me for sure. Both Stallworth and Ford say they've created a friendship that will last forever. I, I don't have the words for it. Yeah, just glad to be here and taking this journey with you. Now both men tell me they hope that one day they will be able to meet the families of their donors. Live in Sacramento, Jeannie Nguyen, Fox 40 News.